thejbeans.net. Cozumel is Mexico's largest Caribbean island and is located off the eastern coast of the Yucatan Peninsula. Cruise ships visiting Cozumel dock at one of three piers on the island's western shore near the town of San Miguel. In this video, we'll provide an overview of the Puerto Maya Cruise Center, which is located at the largest of the three piers and is roughly two and a half miles south of San Miguel. Be careful not to confuse this cruise center with Costa Maya, which is located much further south on the Yucatan Peninsula. The Puerto Maya Cruise Center is typically where Carnival, Princess, and Holland America ships dock. However, ships from other cruise lines also dock there from time to time. To find out if your cruise ship will be docking at the Puerto Maya Cruise Center, check the cruise center's port schedule for the day you'll be in port. After you dock and exit your ship, you'll walk a short distance along the pier to a large gift shop. Walk through the gift shop and exit on the other side to access the cruise center. Just past the gift shop and the end of the pier, you'll find the gathering location for cruise passengers taking ship-sponsored excursions. Several excursions are available, including visits to the nearby Mayan ruins, adventure sports, and all-inclusive beach experiences. Like many other ports, shopping at the cruise center is located just steps away from where the ships dock, with many retail stores offering freebies and raffles. Check the port shopping guides that are handed out on the ship for more details. Also within the cruise center, you'll find shops offering samples to attract customers. Several eateries if you like to grab a bite to eat or drink. Massages. Fish pedicures. Public restrooms and more. Although the peso is the official currency and Spanish is the official language, we had no trouble paying with U.S. dollars and speaking English with the merchants. And while there's not a beach with access to the water at the Puerto Maya Cruise Center, there are some sun loungers available at a man-made beach area. Swimming is prohibited. If you're a fan of kitschy photos, there are quite a few opportunities for fun snapshots at the cruise center. There are also two locations to take photos with a Puerto Maya sign in the background. The first sign is located inside the cruise center and can be accessed by turning left after leaving the pier. You'll find the photo spot just after the ferry pier. The second sign is located just outside of the cruise center, soon after you exit the gates to the area where the taxis pick up. To find this exit, look for the thatched roof covered walkway. The taxis in this area pick up cruise passengers wishing to explore Cozumel on their own. Taxi fare prices are posted in US dollars, and on our cruise, fares were by cab occupancy, not by person. Pricing was listed for numerous destinations, including downtown, a number of popular attractions, beaches, all-inclusive resorts, and private island tours. If you continue towards the street after exiting the cruise center, you'll find locals offering horse and carriage rides. If you cross the street, then turn left and walk along the sidewalk, you'll soon come to an area popular with cruisers and ship's crew. It features a fake Mayan ruin photo op, as well as shops, bars, and restaurants. During our visit, a troupe of aerial artists perform the dance of the voladores and pose for photos for a reasonable tip. We found the prices for goods and services to be less expensive in this area than they were in the Puerto Maya Cruise Center. And prices in general became less expensive the further we walked away from the cruise center area. 
finally, a great resource for planning your day in the Puerto Maya area is the Puerto Maya website. The site features a map of the cruise port area, shop information, taxi fares, and the port schedule.